Somaliland has been initially part of Somalia. The state that has collapsed with, with all of its uh, institutions. But uh, Somalilanders have never been comfortably part of the former state of Somalia. So in 1991, uh, after a long struggle, they have regained their uh, independence and started on a new path of governance uh, under a state called Somaliland. But this new state did not have many of the infrastructures and institutions that the South had. There was only one university in the former state of Somalia, and that was in Mogadishu. All of the students from regions, including Somaliland, used to take the long and expensive journey to uh, Mogadishu. But after the collapse of the Somali state, that small opportunity has been removed. So thousands of young men and women were roaming in these streets. So Ahmad University was started in 1997 to address specifically that problem of young men and women who were desperate for higher education. My name is Hosn Hussein Ibrahim. I was born in Hargeisa. I raised and I finished my secondary school in Mogadishu. Though there's a university in southern Somalia, the reason that I was not joined them because of violences and wars. I moved here at Amut University. Now I'm one of the students who learn education. The reason why I joined or I came to university is to get knowledge and then to trans transform my knowledge to Somali people, to teach them, to make them aware what education is. I want to, to, to encourage them to learn knowledge. Amod started to grow in stages. In 2001, we added a medical program, the Faculty of Medicine, then Agriculture and Environment, then Nursing, then Pharmacy, Laboratory Training, Law and Sharia, Civil Engineering, and Computer Science. From two programs, we have 11 pro programs. Our academic staff is more than 100. Books are very close to 100,000 books. We have got the largest number of computers in, the, in Somaliland, concentrated in one place. We have close to 3,000 students, not only from Somaliland, but they come from Djibouti, from Eastern Ethiopia, from Punlan, and from South Central. So it's a very, very highly integrated uh, institution, which is not confined to this region or even to this country alone. My name is Ahmed Abdullahi. I was born here. I come here to study an IT information technology. It's how to work in computer efficiently and effectively. This is important to learn because it's depending on the infrastructure, the business, the, the teaching, all the things are dependent on IT. Computers are important in Somaliland because it's the way of communicating and Somaliland needs to communicate the world. Amud is not here, I will have to leave the country. After I graduated from Amud University, I went to support my country for business, for communication. Amud University gives Somaliland education and knowledge. My name is Fatima Abu Bakr, director of the nursing school at Amud University. After the civil war, there was a shortage of nurses, there was a shortage of doctors and other health personnel. Most of the people who have been educated have either run away or they must have died. Therefore, there has been a lack of structure in the health care system. This facility is called Al Haya in Medical Center. The hospital, it can take about 90 to 100 beds. The nursing program, at the moment, we have 82 students. In the medical program, we have about 180 students. This hospital, we hope it's, it's the best hospital we have in Somaliland in regards to its space, to where it's located, with the equipment that's available. The vision for the School of Nursing at Amud was to have leaders who will take over and teach nursing or do some research or do administration, do management because we lack all these fields and we hope in the coming 10 years we will have people who have the leadership abilities who can make a difference for, for, for Somaliland. Thousands of young men and women have lost hope. Youth 
go to the warlords or are attracted by the warlords only when they lose hope, when they are so desperate that they see no future for their uh, existence. We're trying to eliminate that factor. We're uh, trying to restore hope for that matter. And restoration of hope is part and parcel of the culture of peace that's gradually spreading throughout Somalia. Our main mission is to provide quality education and training for young men and women in the Horn of Africa and to provide a forum of, for cultures and communities in the Horn of Africa to coexist peacefully together. The reason why I'm learning is to teach Somali generation to change something. Amud University gives Somaliland education and knowledge. There is a lot of work to be done for this country. I can see the vision that this young generation is will make a difference in the future for the country. <laughs>